The Jungle Cruise is getting an update. This has long been rumored and it has now been confirmed. And this is great news. Disney is updating the attraction in an effort to keep it up to date in today's world. The biggest change that the attraction is receiving is that it is getting an entire storyline. And thank you, Disney. This is great. I'll just read what Disney said because I can't write. As part of this story update, we'll get to follow a skipper and his passengers as their journey goes awry. That's right, for the first time ever, the skipper role will not only be that of a live experience and witty guide, but also represented by a show figure within the attraction itself. This is fantastic, and I think that this is the right direction for the attraction. They also released two pieces of concept art, and one is a new scene which has a bunch of chips inhabiting a sunken boat, which is actually one of the original boats from the 1955 attraction. And this also goes along with the story. This is the boat that the passengers abandoned after it began to sink. There is also an updated version of the rhino pole scene with the five new characters, and they actually each have backstories. There is a bird watcher, an emotologist, a wildlife painter, and a photographer, along with the skipper. With these new characters, Disney promises lots of humor that will complement Mark Davis' original vision for the attraction. Again, this is awesome. I'm all for it. Also, Disney mentioned the native people. They are not depicted with accuracy, so they will be changed, but I do not see them fitting in with the storyline, so they're probably going to be removed altogether. The same goes for Trader Sam. The basis for the original rumor of this change was that Disney was planning to incorporate elements from the upcoming film based on the attraction, namely adding Dwayne Johnson. And I'm glad to say that nothing from the film will be added, although they did say that they would add in some easter eggs which I am all for. I didn't want the movie to be part of this, I prefer that it stay original. Now if the movie's good, then I'd be okay with it. I really like the addition of Jack Sparrow and Pirates of the Caribbean, but with the Jungle Cruise for now, I want it to stay original. If the movie is a hit like Pirates of the Caribbean, then I could totally see Disney replacing the new Skipper character with Dwayne Johnson, but I don't think they're gonna do it, which is good. The update is coming to both Disneyland and Walt Disney World, and there will be no differences between the two. What about an opening date? Well, there's nothing set in stone, but I am happy to say that they are trying to get it done by the end of the year. So, late this year or 2022. Okay, that's everything. I'm really excited about this. This is great news for the attraction. I really just cannot wait. Have a magical day.